Okay, uh -huh. we will start the machine now. Okay. Okay, so the machine is started, so we're just waiting. Okay, it takes a while. There we go. And you see several features here. Okay. Start the rinse there. Okay, she's pressing the rings. Continue, press confirm. Okay. Still on the rings mode. There we go. Won't take that long. And you can hear the sound of the water rushing in. Okay, go into the filter. As we mentioned earlier, to the RO machine, to the ultra filtration, ultra filtration filter, to the machine. Okay, you hear the water rushing in. Okay, so we're still on the rinse mode. Takes a while. Okay, now we have a countdown here of uh, one hour. It shows a one hour countdown. Okay. And then once uh, we, this, uh, we will reach, that once we reach, you know, 10 minutes after, after, then we can do our chlorine check. Okay, so there's a countdown. But for the purpose of demonstration, we're not going to wait for the 10 minutes countdown. So maybe after two minutes, we can do our chlorine check. Okay, so right now, we are still waiting for the uh, at least two minutes down. Okay. There you go. So we're still waiting. And we will make it more, we are not going to wait for the 10 minutes countdown. Okay. So there we go. So now we went down, so we'll just start for the purpose of, you know, chlorine check here. Check. Oh, take it, take it. Okay. 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 And then, as I said, we're not going to wait for the 10 minutes. So in here, we will just do our chlorine check. This is only for the purpose of demonstration. So we are collecting now. Okay, uh, I would like to see, I would like to see. So from here, okay. So we got the water sample from P3 and P4. So P3 and P4, that's from that gauge I showed you from P1 to P4. We will get this uh, specimen or this sample of water from P3 and P4, and we will put the strip. Okay, that is the, this is now the chlorine check. Okay. Okay, so that's the chlorine check. And while waiting for that, okay, so we, we are not rushing actually to, to, uh, to see the results in here, but this is the lug sheet that we use when we start. So that's the lug sheet. 
we put the date today and the system is rinsed we put a check the chlorine check we will do that later okay and we will do the reading on pressure one two three and four so i will do the reading and uh, in here i will use a flashlight okay for the reading and uh, you see that we got a maximum we only get the maximum reading here so we got here uh, 62 63 as the pressure one and this one is okay I should say this is 59 so we have a 63 and 59 63 and 59 and then the P3 P4 so the pressure one and the pressure two you get the highest readings so here we got 63 and here I got 59 and we will get the low readings for the lower gauges. So in here, okay, I have here at 36, and this one I have here at 38. So 36 and 38. So those were the pressure. Okay, so rinse, we did the rinse, yes. And we do the chlorine check and uh, we did the pressure reading here, 63. We have here 62 and 30 plus for these two. You have to write them down and now we can go and check with the chlorine test. So that's the chlorine and let's take a look. So we will compare with the chart. Here we go. So the first one is yellow. That is yellow right there. So that is yellow. So that's yellow. This is yellow. The second one is yellow. Okay, so that means it's good. So the chlorine check is good. We're done with the chlorine check. Okay, so as soon as we finish this check, we will proceed now with the disinfection. Okay, we stop the rinse and we press the confirm. Okay, so you got a four minutes countdown and now we can start the hooking so because we have a four minutes countdown we start hanging our normal saline okay so there will be normal saline to be hanged okay there we go so normal saline so that's one and we need another one to be hanged okay we will be that's to be yeah we will uh, we need another one to be hung here. So this is normal ceiling one, and we need another normal ceiling. So this is for the arterial line, and the other one is for the, okay, in case we, that's for bolusing the patient. And we need that on also during recirculation. So the arterial line, and this is during recirculation, but at the end, we actually, this is already as a standby bolus for the patient, should the patient go hypertensive during procedure. Okay, so we hang those two saline bags, and now we still have a countdown of three. We got a countdown of three minutes. 